Good morning guys, welcome back to another video. I was planning for today's vlog to be a home vlog, like I actually didn't have any plans to leave the house today, but my mum asked if I wanted to go on a mini shopping trip with her, well, hardly really a shopping trip. But she texted me this morning and she asked if I wanted to go to Dunelm, Homesense and Argos and couldn't say no to a little shopping trip, so we are gonna be doing that today. However, the time is currently 10 past nine. Aiden has a football game today, so I'm about to make us our tea and coffee, going to make Aiden an egg roll, and he wants to take some pasta with him, so I'm gonna make the pasta now, just so then it's already done and I don't have to stress about it later. But I also really wanna film a video today. Can't tell you guys what the video is, um, because I feel like it might give it away a little bit, but I need to film that video today and get that all edited and uploaded because I really want to start pre-filming just so I'm like ready for the year. But it is currently Monday the 2nd of January and I feel like I had a, I don't feel like, I know I had a day off yesterday, like yesterday. I didn't do anything all day and I just, it was nice to be honest, just to have a day of nothing after the whole Christmas thing. But it is Monday, the second day, obviously a bank holiday. So I'm gonna try and be productive. I really wanna do a workout as well at some point today just to get into the swing of things. to home bargains i'll give you guys a little haul when we get home which is really now, well yeah we, we we went in there just to look and then walked out with like a whole bag full of stuff but we're going into dunelm because we need bedding my mum wants to get a new duvet and bedding currently walking around dunelm in the towels my mum said she said i'm having fun i can tell I did. Yeah. we've been picking up bedding and a new duvet and now some new towels so our next stop is Sainsbury's because we need ink, a clothes rail, and a kettle. Three very important things. Uh, yes, thank you. Yeah, hopefully. I mean, Dunelm had both like the clothes rail and the kettle, but they were a little bit pricey. And Argos, which is obviously in Sainsbury's, is going to be a lot cheaper. Oh, my mum's got a new white coat. It's a bit dirty, but it's very dirty. That that was kind of expected with a white coat. So we've been literally just walking, walk, walking, <laughs> walked through the front door and I'm gonna give you guys a haul of everything that we got, not just the things that I got. So, where to start? I think I'll start with Home Bargains because that is where we went first. We also got this super cute bag, Minnie Mouse. We got a microfiber dry mat to go on our sink draining board because we currently have a tea towel but now we've actually got a proper drying thing we then got this universal over the door rail so you can like put it over your cupboard doors and put your tea towels onto it next up carpet cleaner this is the best stuff if you guys remember in the old house i dropped coffee on the floor and it stunk like cheese because of the milk and that is the only thing that got the smell out of it we then got some parcel tape my brother then loves these rain energy drinks i don't drink energy drinks but he loves them so you've got three of those got aiden a water bottle because he doesn't have one although this is it's quite quite a small one but it will do him just fine we were kind of just walking around home bargains having a look and anything that was like cheap and we could do within our lives we picked it up so we got two of these travel adapters because the ones that we have now are really crusty and gross so we got two new ones they were 99p each as well which i think is super duper good and then some cleaning products we got an oven and grill cleaner a hob cleaner, some descaler, and then we got, look how cute this little bag of tea bags are. So adorable. And then obviously from Argos, we got our ink. We couldn't find a kettle and couldn't, well, we could find a kettle and we could find a clothes arrow, but they were really expensive. So we didn't get them. And then we went to Dunelm and I actually think it's probably my mum's first ever time going into a Dunelm, which is kind of crazy because she was walking around and she was like, oh my God, this is so great. And she, we, well, we ended up spending 133 pounds. Bear in mind, that's for two of us. And we got two big things that I'll show you guys in a second. And this whole bag full of stuff. Oh, that's my water bottle in there. Defo did not buy that from Dunelm. So my mum decided to get a new duvet. And this says it was £45, but it's scanned as £36. 
So not too sure why, but she got herself a new duvet and I got myself a mattress topper and that was only £30, which again, I don't think is horrendous. And then we went a bit crazy on the bed in front. So my mum got a new duvet set and everything that we got was basically in the sale. So this is what my mum's one looks like very nice and well suited she then also got so my mum has like the big square pillows as well so she got two pillowcases to go on those i then got a brushed cotton fitted sheet and a nice like brownie color it's quite nice and then i also picked up a new duvet set and it just looks like this i kind of already have one like this from asda but i got a new one because I'm in need of some new duvet covers. And the last thing we got, <laughs> really random, but these were reduced from four pounds to two pounds. They're just like the reusable little shopping bags and they're so nice and small, so you can just shove them in your bag and off you go. But that is everything that we got. I don't, what is the time? Because I'm hungry. It is 2.22, so I think I'm gonna have some soup and probably chillax, put this stuff away because this all needs new homes now. I wish I was coming on here to be like, guys, I've been so busy and done so much exciting stuff. I have not. I've played a bit of Sims and then I just went downstairs and I descaled our kettle, exciting stuff, and doesn't stop there. I also cleaned our hob, so fun stuff. But I'm just about to do some work. I'm gonna start editing this vlog that you guys are currently watching just to take the workload off of me because I am back to my normal admin job. When I say I'm back, I don't really have any time off over Christmas because we still work over Christmas. But I am working tomorrow, so I obviously need to get things edited and I also really wanna edit the video that I filmed today. Also, can I just say that I completely understand how me like alluding to things and like not really saying what's happening is annoying like i had a dm earlier and it didn't upset me but like someone's like i hate it when people do this like just say and i get it's annoying but it's fun to build excitement and like so many of you guys are excited and once you know what the announcement is like you'll understand why i didn't want to just say it quickly and you'll understand why the process was so long for me to tell you so yeah, I'm sorry for being really annoying. I know it's annoying because, you know, I'm just a normal girl and I always watch YouTubers and they always say they're doing exciting things. I'm so confused. My camera literally just cut out. Like, I'm sure for no reason. I've got memory on my SD card and I have battery. But as I was saying, <laughs> sorry, now you guys are all wonky but i'm a normal girl as well i watch youtubers who are always like oh my god there's something exciting happening and i can't say and i know it's annoying but it gets everyone excited i'm really excited for the announcement so i do apologize for being one of those I don't say influencers but one of those youtubers but by the time you guys are watching this you got under a week until the announcement's out and if you've been really eagle-eyed i'd say that you can guess it but no one's guessed it so maybe I'm not being that obvious. <laughs> I really don't know. I've had some really out there guesses and so far no one has guessed correctly. But anyway, I need to get busy. Video is uploading. Did you guys just see that? I'm not too sure. <laughs> it doesn't really give it away that much, but I've just uploaded the video that is going live, I think on Thursday. Not tomorrow as you guys are watching this, but the week after. But who am I watching on TV? Oh God, around you. I am obsessed. With kitchen nightmares usa like it is the best show i'm sure that i've watched them all like def i've seen this one so many times but they have full episodes on youtube sometimes even like triple episodes it's like three hours worth of gordon ramsay insulting people and it's just hilarious but it is currently 6 30 well just about to turn 6 30 so i think that i'm gonna go and make some dinner i mean it's pretty late for me to be having dinner but I didn't have lunch to, I think, like, two-ish. I should know this because I've literally also just edited the start of this vlog. But I think Aiden and I are going to have the IKEA meatballs. They are the plant ones, so they're not quite as good. Like, I do try and eat vegetarian as much as possible, but nothing can beat, like, meat things. <laughs> I just have to say it. However, I'm going to go make that now. I've been putting it off because I've been really hoping that Aiden was going to be home kind of soon. It feels like a Saturday as well. It does not feel like a Monday because obviously he's at football. But I was waiting for Aiden to come home because you guys know he's the designated potato peeler of the family and he's not here. So now I have to go peel the potatoes and I hate it. I just do not like peeling potatoes. But if I want to eat anytime soon, I should probably go do it myself. So I'm going to go do that now. And you guys can come with me, actually, because I don't want to go and do it on my own. 
<laughs> oh, you bearded potatoes, you're so funny. It's nice to hold it and go yeah, like that. I know, but no, we don't have one of those proper peelers. No, I know, but I normally go like that. I literally do not want a single comment about how I'm peeling these potatoes, okay? Because it's honestly a miracle me even doing this right now. Maybe I should have just bought pre made. People do it like this. That seems really dangerous. I can't be doing that. vlogger this evening but to be fair I've been doing things that I ha can't vlog just yet so sorry for being boring but it is currently five past eleven that clip is hurting my hair and I think I'm just gonna go and get in the shower and get ready for bed because we need to start going to bed earlier because we are not going to bed until like after 12 right now and we are really acting like kids who need to get back into like a proper sleep schedule for work like before work starts even though my work starts tomorrow aiden's got until wednesday so you've actually only got one night tonight to sort your sleeping schedule so i'm gonna go ahead and end this video here i hope that you all did enjoy it if you did be sure to leave a massive thumbs up comment down below what you thought and obviously if you guys aren't already then make sure to subscribe also turn on the post notifications i never say that but the next video is the announcement which is crazy because i filmed that back in like november and it's finally time so you definitely want to be around for that it'll be out on tuesday at 7 p.m so i shall see you all there bye